tachysystolic atrial fibrillation requires control of the heart ventricular rate, which, according to current European and American guidelines, should be below 110 BPM at rest. But this criterion is not enough, and I want to add a couple of important ones. When monitoring antiarrhythmic drug therapy, it is necessary to prevent a slowdown in heart rate below 55 BPM. It is critical to maintaining an adaptive heart rate response under stress. Antiarrhythmic drugs in the control of heart rate should not suppress it. Under stress, the simplest example is normal walking, the heart rate must necessarily increase. An increase in heart rate of 10-15% is appropriate.